the battle lines have been drawn uh, ahead of the local government elections. The DA has announced that incumbent Mayor Patricia DeLille will be the face of its election campaign in Cape Town. The official opposition in the province, the ANC, is still pondering whether to pronounce on a mayoral candidate. Parties are preparing for the campaign trail. Although no date has yet been set, the election machinery is beginning to grind. The DA commends the little track record. She was voted the world's best mayor in 2013. Ultimately, she's been a strong fighter against corruption. That a total of 484 employees were dismissed from the city of Cape Town between 2011 and 2014 for various transgressions, including corruption, unethical and dishonest conduct and theft. So we've certainly acknowledged her history, we've acknowledged her contribution. And she's clear about future priorities. We've always been working as the city. We didn't look at black, white or coloured areas. We deliver more than 67% of our budget to poor people. Um, I know we've been accused of delivering services in... Um, and, and white areas. Delil's dismissed claims that Cape Town is the most racist city in the country. She says according to the Human Rights Commission, more racism complaints are reported in Gauteng and KwaZulu-Natal. She says the city will be distributing millions of pamphlets to fight racism. The ANC hopes to regain control of the city they lost in 2006. It is that uh, projected strategy of the ANC that matters. However, we do know there is a possibility in some strategic areas, like Cape Town, uh, where we possibly must discuss the potential of putting up um, a candidate. Ordinary citizens have high expectations. The mayor that I expect, you know, is somebody that is, you know, serving the people that's honest and, you know, transparent. You know, that's not lying to the people, they're not telling the people straightforward. I think a mayor that will just kind of bring people together, unity, um, and, you know, just, you know, like I said, unity, I guess, you know, somebody will, you know, make people gel. Other big players in the province, like the EFF and COPE, say they are national leaders will be the face of their campaigns. Ulilani Philip, SABC News, Cape Town.